And then Dave has just brought his little tortoise. <laughs> I now have a tortoise. I don't know where I should keep it. Just, just my little to go in the garden, I suppose. No. No, look at this. It is a tortoise. Um, Rada, what on earth do you want to do with it now? I think I'll have to go and put it there in the back. Okay, I think I'll put it in the back. But you won't believe this now. It's almost look petrified. As well, as tiny as it is, it looks petrified. So I'm going to put it in here. There it goes. Let's see what happens. Friends and viewers, if I have not told you this yet, somebody brought me a little tortoise. A plain school bikey in Afrikaans. It was crossing the road and the cars were driving to kill it. She stopped and picked it up. And here I have a tortoise. <laughs> I think we must call it Jurassic. And Jurassic has decided that he's comfortable enough to show himself today. That Jurassic is going to eat some grass. <laughs> it took him some time. I think it's day three for Jurassic. <laughs> No, it goes an hide away from me. I wonder if they can recognize voices and faces. Jurassic is hiding. <laughs> Jurassic? Jurassic? It is so many animals, so many times. <laughs> Jurassic? Hello, Bob Bobs. Jurassic? Did he stretch his head out a little bit when I called? <laughs> there's, no, there's no way that this fellow will know his name by now. Jurassic. I think he blinked his eyes. <laughs> I'm being silly. Somebody's cell phone is ringing. No. It's bagpipes. Jurassic? Why would I be hearing bagpipes, I wonder? Well, in any case, Jurassic is not going to give us any excitement. But that is Jurassic. He's the size of my hand. <laughs> <laughs> 